Welcome everybody to the Esoteric Cosmos live show. It's Justin Varengia. Rosebud Kincaid. And boy oh boy is all I could say. Yeah. Um, we exciting had, weekend. We had the most exciting weekend I've ever had in my entire life. Thrilling. Thrilling. And we spotted, some of you already know, we spotted uh, several UFOs in the sky and we actually got this on tape with the video camcorder. Well, we're going to be showing you that footage today. Uh, we're going to probably shoot right into it and uh, get you uh, uh, seeing what orbs look like. And um, we did uh, contact uh, Project Camelot and Dr. Stephen Greer to give us some official uh, explanation of what these orbs were. Uh, so up until that point, we're just going to just show you what we think it is and what we saw. Yeah, so we're just going to show the exact footage because we recorded over 30 minutes of this footage. Actually about 35 minutes. I got a, a few minutes with the iPhone and I didn't release that yet, but I will eventually um, as soon as I get the chance. So let's get right into the footage and then we're going to discuss what we saw. I want you to pay real close attention here because what you're about to see, this just happened August 13th. Uh, 2009, just a few days ago, and we're going to tie in some miss missing pieces later. So let me get this footage and uh, pull it right up for you guys. And we will do Q&A afterwards, so prepare your questions. I'd love to uh, help answer We've those. We've already got a ton of questions. Boy, the, our uh, email has been popping. Yes, incredibly. Thousands. Let's see here video folder and here we go so what I'm gonna do actually is show you clip there's four clips on YouTube to this footage we're gonna show you clip three and clip four because they're the most exciting to me because we see some unexplainable phenomenal things uh, happening within these videos and I believe it was at what 930 it started 930 at night on 13 yeah it was actually um, yeah 830 is when we were heading out you know to get some dinner and we noticed uh, them in the streets. So probably about 9, 9.30, this was all occurring till probably about 10.30. Yes. It lasted all night, uh, pretty much. Here we go. So pay close attention to these videos. Yes. All of just energy. Do you see that, Rosebud? Yeah, I see it. In the... That's not... I don't know. I don't know. It looks just like what... And why is it still there? They're not moving. It's not. They may be coming close, but it's been sitting there for a long time. Don't the planes fly if it was the plane? And there's that long one there. What's there's it? something. Yeah, and I noticed them over there. They had like right under each other. That's not normal. You don't see them sitting right under each other like I've seen on the iPhone. And there's no military base or anything right here, so I don't know where that would be. That's weird. Okay, so now it's going them off. And now those two are there. It's all flying in weird formation, circling. Obviously not looking for nothing because there's no spotlight. And when there's an airplane looking for something, it would be a helicopter right. with the spotlight shining down. We got what I seen earlier up close. I seen some top, top, and when I say top, just very high-tech looking um, aircraft, like something could be military, you know, stealth craft or something like that, just flying incredibly slow, incredibly low. And they were circling this bright, 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 bright obje object. And we've just been seeing, uh, you know, some of them just, you know, disappear. And then they'd appear on the other side of the street when we were chasing them. Now they just seem to come this way, whatever they are. I don't know. But there's three in the sky. Yeah, I see. Flying and that, I mean... That one... That one looks weird, too. It just... Maybe it's a new aircraft that the military is testing or something. There's another one coming that way now. Okay, that one just blew into... D's seen it pretty close, too. Okay, well, that one's just turning around, I guess. Okay, that one's turning around. 
They must be. I've never seen an aircraft. Um, I don't know. They must be something that they're, uh, like you said. Let me zoom in on this one. Because that has like the three lights. And there's a one closer okay. here. That's almost like a helicopter. Here we go. Do you see this? Yep. It'll zoom. It'll get the contrast a little better. That's the one flying off? Yeah, in front of the other ones. It looks like an orb as well on the camera. Hmm. Unless we have aircraft now that can do that. Who really knows? So there's the last two. It's like they have, and if it is some secret government plane or something, it's like there's some force field around them protecting them, some sort of energy, or it wouldn't pick up, you would think, as a perfect orb. It's just very, very weird. Yeah. We and now they're doing the same thing where they're going to go under each other. I don't know what that means, but we're going to keep an eye on here on the camera. See if we see anything amazing happen from here. Nothing. And they're all triangular looking. Yeah, this must be, I mean, I'm thinking... Triangular from a distance, and when you zoom in, it's just one perfect circle. Yeah. Or... This must be something, I don't know if it's extraterrestrial or something that, that the government is working on. Now here's the last one. This is the last bright thing I see in the sky that is right, not that far from where we're at right now. So I must have seen at least a dozen different odd UFO, unidentified flying objects in the sky, which could possibly be military top, you know, secret planes. They're doing some sort of test. And now there's more stuff coming in. Or this could actually be an extraterrestrial in this energy orb. We don't know. We have no idea. We're just filming.